In this video, we'll demonstrate how easy it is to incorporate functionality from jQuery libraries into Alpha 5 Grid and Dialog components. So in this particular example, a user here has created a page, a regular just HTML page, that has a div on it that you can drag around and uh, when you drop it, you get an alert. So if you go and you examine this uh, page, you'll see here that there um, is a pattern that's very familiar to uh, jQuery users. Uh, you can see that uh, in this page um, we're loading the uh, jQuery uh, library, uh, in this case from, from Google. And then let me just uh, resize this over here. You can see that in the um, document ready uh, event, so uh, once all the page has been loaded, we're executing some jQuery code over here and we're using the, the dollar sign operator because that's uh, jQuery's um, uh, default operator. And uh, we're, we're um, basically making this div here called draggable uh, into a draggable div. So this is how it was done on a, uh, an HTML page. So now let's go and examine how this is done in a dialog component. So the first thing you'll notice is that we don't have to actually load the jQuery libraries because uh, Alpha 5 automatically loads the jQuery libraries. Then what we've done is we've just put some static text uh, on the dialog and in the static text we've got this div um, that is going to be draggable and we've got the ID of draggable. So um, that puts the div uh, on the page and now um, uh, in order to uh, attach the jQuery uh, event handler to that div, we go to client side events over here, and then we go to the on render complete, and you can see there's our um, uh, jQuery. But the key issue here uh, is that you can't use the dollar sign jQuery default operator because Alpha 5's JavaScript library preempts that and. Uh, uh, Alpha 5 uses the dollar sign operator in its JavaScript library to get a pointer to an object. So instead you have to use uh, jQuery's uh, more formal um, uh, object name which is jQuery. So here we attach um, the code to the div and now when we go to working preview we see our div and then we can drag it around and everything works uh, as you would expect it. And if you go and you view um, source over there, you'll see that uh, the JavaScript library uh, has been loaded and then um, here we've executed the jQuery no conflict command which uh, tells jQuery that um, the dollar sign operator is not to be interpreted by jQuery because Alpha 5 owns it. So the only trick in effect here uh, in taking code that you might read on the internet um, for jQuery and translating it into a grid or a dialog component is that number one you need to use uh, the word jQuery and not dollar sign and that code that would have gone into the uh, uh, page uh, render complete event uh, over here in the um, the document ready event instead will go into the on render complete event of the dialog or grid component thanks very much for watching